Hey everyone, CFL Park Hopper here at Universal Orlando's Cabana Bay Beach Resort. From this resort, if you're going to go to the Universal theme parks, you're going to need to take a bus. As we said, for the water park, you can walk, and the walkway is straight down this way, all the way at the end where that tower is. Um, you'd walk all the way down to there, and that'd be the entrance. So there's a sign here that says, Volcano Bay Resort Guest Entrance. So you just keep following this path. But to go to City Walk or Universal Studios or Islands of Adventure, you're going to take a bus, and it's going to drop you off at the City Walk, and then you're gonna go into Universal Studios and Islands Adventure. So here is the bus stop area where you will get the bus. Okay, so we're coming into the lobby. This is the lobby of the Cabana Bay. It's 1950s, but it's very Jetson-esque, I think. So here's the check-in area over here. And they have a bar and lounge over here, also in the lobby area. Okay, and this is one side of the resort with the hotel rooms. And this is one of the pools. Right now they're closed um, due to lightning in the area, even though it's sunny outside. This pool has a water slide. And they even have a beach and game area over here. And they have a bar and eatery over here as well. All right, back inside the lobby, they have a giant universal gift shop. About anything that you can get in the parks you have here at your resort hotel. So, you know, you look for souvenirs in the park, but maybe you don't want to carry them around. You can come into your hotel gift shop and get them. They sell the Harry Potter wands and robes and brooms, all the Harry Potter candies. So this is pretty neat, because it would save you time inside the parks by just getting it here in your hotel room before you leave. So lots of Harry Potter stuff. And then they have Cat in the Hat stuff, Minion stuff, Despicable Me. I guess Minions are Despicable Me, sorry. Universal shirts, Cabana Bay clothing. If you want a shirt to come right your resort, stay. Fast and Furious merchandise, Simpsons merchandise. Jurassic Park merchandise, the superhero merchandise, Marvel superhero island merchandise, swimming suits in case you want to get a new bathing suit, and there's some men's bathing suits and things on this wall. So lots of great stuff here at the Universal Gift Shop. When you come out the other side of the gift shop, they have a giant Starbucks. So you can get your coffee and you can sit in this area. It's a nice lounging area here. All right, and then down here is the food court, the Bayliner Diner. Before we go in the diner though, I'm gonna go back up by the Starbucks. There's a gigantic staircase, and we're gonna go up there and see what's upstairs. And it's a bowling alley. They have a bowling alley here in the hotel. How cool is that? So you can bowl and you can eat. Here's the menu. Sandwiches and burgers, appetizers, and bowling. So this is something really cool you can do on your vacation. Especially if you're here in the summer, it does rain a lot in the afternoons here in Florida. So this might be a good rain time activity to do since the pools will be closed. They have a bar and lounge, and then through this side, they have a gigantic arcade. So that's pretty cool. Ooh, they got ski ball. That's always my favorite as a kid. So pretty fun up here, upstairs in the Cabana Bay Beach Resort. Down here, past the bowling alley, upstairs they have a fitness center. Jack Lalar Lalayan. Not really sure what that says in cursive. I think those are N's. Maybe maybe they're R's. Jack Lalar Physical Fitness Center. So, can't really see in. They have this kind of glass on the outside, but that's kind of cool. A lot of people don't like to be stared at while they're working out, but they do have a lot of treadmills I can see and exercise machines. So, if you're into working out, this could be something that you could do while you're here on vacation. 
Then there is this walkway outside, and this is really neat because this crosses, this is the pool that we just showed you from downstairs where the water slide was. I'm gonna step out for a second so you can see better. But this was the courtyard side that I showed you. So you could come up this walkway and into the building this way from the pool area or maybe if your room is on this side. So that's kind of a neat way to get inside the hotel building. Now Cabana Bay Beach Resort is Universal's value resort. So it is the cheapest of the five hotels on the property. But I think the rooms are a really good size for what you get. And we're gonna show you the inside of a Volcano Bayview room because two of the towers buildings of this resort back right up next to Volcano Bay. So we're able to look inside one of the rooms. My parents are staying here on property this weekend so we're getting a special look at what the room looks like. And I think they're a really good size room. If you've ever stayed in the value resorts at Disney, this value resort, the rooms are much bigger than what you would get at Disney. So, and they're the same price. So I think it's a little bit more for your money and some good amenities here. You know, none of the Disney resorts have a bowling alley inside. Um, and they have two pools and a very large food court. So very well worth the money. The only problem is with the uh, value resort here at Universal, you do not get express passes to the parks. If you stay at the top tiered resorts like Portofino Bay, Hard Rock Hotel, or Royal Pacific Hotel, you do get express pass. So you do not get that with the bottom tier resort. But I think if you're kind of more into going to the water park like Volcano Bay, this would be a good resort because you can walk directly to Volcano Bay from this resort and all the other hotels have to take a bus. So if you're definitely planning on the water park, this might be a, a good resort option to consider. Okay, now we're looking down on the other side of the resort. These room buildings are definitely different than the other side. The other side had like the outdoor um, hotel room look. These buildings are inside with floor to um, ceiling windows for their hotel rooms. So that's nice. They do have a pool on this side. Um, again, I can't go in the pool area right now because they have the pool areas locked due to the lightning. You can't even get into those gates down there. But this pool um, is a really nice pool. You can walk into the pool. It's one of those where you walk in and it gets deeper as you go. So that's kind of a nice feature. And this pool also has a lazy river on one side. So that's a cool um, thing. And you can buy inner tubes here at this resort to use in their lazy river, or you can bring inner tubes from home. So that's kind of cool. So one side has the water slide and the other side has the lazy river. And as you can see, you can see the volcano on this side for Volcano Bay. And that tower building right here, that's where my parents are staying. And there's two towers, there's one over this way, which you can't see from the building right now. But we're gonna head down there in a little bit and show you the room. We're now in the eating area, which is called the Bayline Diner. And it's a giant food court, and look at all the area to sit. And what I think is really cool is if you sit and watch the TVs, they're all like old school TV commercials. I'm doing Kool-Aid right now. So it's pretty entertaining. Takes you back to your childhood, perhaps. All right, let's go check out the food. In the food court, they have all kinds of bottled drinks and stuff that you can get, and they have snacks that you can get for your room. And these cups they have that would be refillable throughout your stay. They have a frozen yogurt bar. Let's look at the flavors of this. Mango sorbet, original tart, cable car chocolate, and sugar-free vanilla. So that sounds kind of cool. They do have a deli section. Looks like they have sandwiches, gourmet sandwiches, and they have some desserts. They have a pizza and pasta. It's pretty popular. They have a salad bar where you're building your own salad. That looks good if you want to try a healthier option. This area has all kinds of stuff. Um, shrimp and grits, Brazilian beef churrasco, honey roasted lemon chicken, seared salmon filet, vegetarian lo mein. Mm, I'm getting hungry reading the menu. And over here they got burgers and fries. So lots of great options. They even have an icy machine. <laughs> over here there's more grab and go stuff. Look, they have a s'mores kit because I did see a campfire outside, which I'll show you later. So that's kind of cool. 
and all kinds of snacks and stuff that you could get if you wanted to take stuff into the park or go back to the room and chill out and have a dessert maybe there's some cheesecake and cupcakes in here muffins croissants candy so lots of great options here at the Bayline Diner okay so we're here looking at the Volcano Bay View room at Cabana Bay Beach Resort and here are the rooms this is the beds this is a lovely blue color and the room here is really spacious and you have such a great view come check this out man oh man all the slides and there's the volcano it's really neat so this is really going to keep you entertained while you're sitting here in your room as you can see my stepdad's enjoying the view having his coffee from his little coffee maker Cuisinart how's it taste good excellent a nice TV, nice chest of drawers. And we noticed like it has a lot of old school touches because the Cabana Bay is supposed to be like a 1950s theme. So we noticed like the little old school alarm clock and the lamp above his head. And so come in here in the bathroom and we'll show you some more stuff. And now I'm looking in the shower and look, they have Zest Soap and VO5 shampoo and conditioner. Don't even know if you can find VO5 anywhere nowadays. But this is the shower. It's a stand-up stall. It's really spacious, so that's nice. But you don't get a tub at all um, in these rooms, just the stand-up shower. And you have your bathroom in there, and then you have the sink out here. So someone can be in here in the shower, and someone else can be out here getting ready at the sink. So that's nice. Um, their closet is also really spacious. They were able to fit all of their luggage into it. There's still hangers. There's the iron and ironing board if you need that as well. So it's a great little room. Here at Cabana Bay, check it out when you're staying at Universal Orlando Resort. Well everyone, we hope you liked our tour today from the Cabana Bay Beach Resort here at Universal Orlando. And we hope it gave you a good insight of the one of the hotels here at Universal that you could stay at on your vacation. If you liked the video, hit like and subscribe down below to see more. Thanks for watching.